An on-piler is a clever piece of kit that diverts your excess solar to your hot water to reduce what you draw from the grid. While the on-pilot will make decisions to make sure you are optimizing your solar use, you can also set boost times to make sure your hot water is hot when you need it. We do this for you when we set it up, but if you ever need to make changes, here's how you do it. On the front of your on-pilot, you'll see a button with three options next to it. If you press this button three times, it will boost your hot water cylinder and it will pull from the grid or your solar to give an immediate heating of the water. If you press it twice, it'll open up the access point. This is what we're going to do now to show you some of the settings. So press that button twice and then go onto your phone, go onto your network settings and find the OnPilot network. Select this and log into it. It may need a password of 12345678. Once you're connected, open up a web browser and put in the IP address of 192.168.250.181. This will log you into the home screen for the OnPilot where you can see the settings, the current temperature, and if you scroll down, there's also another way to boost here by hitting boost mode. This will do the same as pressing the button three times on the front of the OnPilot. If you scroll back to the top, we can go to the top right corner and select the drop down and go into general. Here you can change quite a few settings. Um, we can change when the boost periods are, as well as the Legionella prevention. We want to make sure that is on. So we're just setting that to 72 hours. This will just cycle our hot water, hot water cylinder and make sure it's hot. Remember to hit save on any settings that you change. So now we're going to look at our boost periods. This is where we can set times that the hot water cylinder will heat regardless of the solar to make sure that we have hot water. We're making them from two to seven and we're making it a minimum of 50 degrees. So if it's above 50 degrees, then it won't pull from the grid at these times. But if it's below, it will come on and pull from the grid to heat to that temperature. We've got two settings in here, one overnight and one in the afternoon before our peak period starts. Remember to hit save at the bottom of this as well. Now you can also change the internet settings here as well. Once you've seen these ones, we can go back onto the top corner and go into network. And in network, you'll see that it is currently connected to a network, but if it wasn't here, you can select this and find the network and connect. And just don't forget to hit save. These are all of the settings that we're showing you today for the OnPilot.